Welcome to the tax platform where we discuss various matters on tax. On today's episode, we are talking or discussing a transfer duty, specifically for tribal land. And on the show, I'm with Melorana, who is a tax expert or tax consultant. Welcome to the show, sir. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, first of all, like I'm saying, we're going to be talking about transfer duty, specifically for tribal land. I mean, we can talk about free land, freehold land, or state land still on transfer duty but first of all I need you to take us through what exactly transfer duty is um, thank, thank you very much yeah um, transfer duty in, in simple terms is, is a tax levied on transfer of property so it's, it's, it's not only on the purchase because somebody can buy property and then they're just transfer duty but someone can be given property as a gift or they inherit uh, property from someone else. Okay. St- still transfer duty applies or maybe you are, you are transferring a property from an individual to, to a company, still transfer duty applies. So it's not always on purchase but just on transfer. Okay. Yes. So now that we're talking tribal land, is transfer duty applicable on, on such a matter? Um, yes. Effective uh, 1st of March 2020. Uh, tribal land now was subject to, to duty. Before that, uh, transfer duty was only applicable on freehold land and state land. Uh, but after the changes that were made uh, to increase the tax base, the tax base for transfer duty, or yeah, or the tax base generally, so that the revenue services can have uh, more people being taxed and obviously more income coming into their coffers, they decided to. Yes, I uh, make sure that transfer duty now is applicable on tribal land. Okay. Before that, uh, there was no tra- transfer duty on tribal land. Sure. I hear you talk about tax base. Yes. So now take us through what tax base for tribal land is. Yes, um, there are two uh, methods when it comes to transfer duty on tribal land. So it's, it, you can either use the market value of such land or such property or the aggregate uh, payable rental uh, value for that property or that land. You know that uh, tribal land sometimes is given in 15 years, uh, especially if it's a concession, whether it was a new concession or a family concession. Sometimes uh, a commercial land is 25 years and a residential place is 99 years. So yes, depending on the value of that land or the rental payable to the land board or to state on that land, you'll be charged uh, based on that. So let's take, for example, some a tourism concession in Maui. You'll be paying two million per year and the concession is 50 runs for 15 years. So 15 years times two million per year, 30 million. The 30 million is the tax base for transfer duty. So you please use either apply 5% if you are a citizen or 80% if you are a non-citizen. So it will always be the higher of the rental aggregate amount or the market value. But most of the, most of the time, uh, the rental, the aggregate rent paid to the land board is, is higher. Okay. Mm. Is there a need to declare a transfer of such land? And if there is, what are the consequences of not declaring transfer of such land? Yes, yeah, you, you have to declare because, uh, so, I mean, transfer duty is a self-assessment tax. Um, actually, uh, it's, it's based on self-declaration. So if you don't declare, um, and best find out later that you had not declared uh, such transfer of land, um, you are going to be charged a maximum of twenty thousand penalty. I mean, it's a minimum actually, minimum of twenty thousand penalty for not declaring. Yeah, because they'll say no, you are evading tax, mm-hmm. and also you will be charged one point five percent interest on what you should have supposed to paid at that time when you transfer the land and the interest is also kept to whatever duty that would have been payable on that uh, amount. Okay, okay, great. This was the text platform on transfer duty, specifically on tribal land. And for more information about transfer duty, either on tribal land or any other that we have talked about or mentioned, it's to have 
been able to discuss. You can check out our social media platforms on Facebook or on Twitter at the text platform or subscribe to our YouTube channel at Dumel Run Now. This is the text platform informing the nation on text matters. Thank you and see you in the next episode.